Hi, I'm Kat Shea and this is Trailers from Hell. Today we're looking at the trailer for Dog Day Afternoon, which is my favorite movie of all time. And I feel honored that I have the chance to comment on this trailer. You know something, people? You're going to be remembered the rest of your lives for the day you got held up and kidnapped. This trailer totally captures the humor and the tone of the movie. Sonny, Al Pacino's character, is so in over his head carrying out a bank robbery, it's ridiculous. Maybe the reason I love this character and his sidekick, Sal, played by the incredibly great John Cazale, is that they are so dumb and heartbreaking. This is how a bank robbery would go if I were to try it. The movie's listed as a thriller, and it has all the tension of a thriller, yet the humor and tragedy of real life. Not only are the bank robbers in over their heads, but the cops are too. It's based on a true story, and the cops are not like cops on TV or in the movies. As hours pass, the cops lose perspective on how to handle the situation. I particularly appreciate this now because I have a close friend who's a police captain, and as capable as he is, I see the human side, and I see how brilliantly the cops were portrayed. Frank Pearson must have had so much fun writing this. You start to feel that Al Pacino and John Cazale have taken up residence in the bank as they become sort of emotionally involved with their hostages. The hostages are the only ones who aren't in over their heads. At one point, one of the bank tellers chews Sonny out for not planning the robbery better. I saw this movie when I was pretty young, and I'm certain it influenced my filmmaking. I was always trying to write characters that you shouldn't like, but learn to love because of their humanness, their human frailty. As I was watching the trailer to do this commentary, I realized how much influence the movie had on me. In 1988, I made a vampire movie that basically takes place in one location, where the vampire reveals his vulnerabilities to a girl he holds hostage over the space of one night. They become very emotionally intimate. It has a similar claustrophobic quality. I always said that I don't have any cinematic influences, really. I just write stuff and then find the coolest way to tell the story. But now, I really think that maybe all the movies I've ever made have been shaped by Dog Day Afternoon. The real humanity depicted left an indelible imprint on me. All the performances are beyond great. The writing is beyond brilliant. It's Sidney Lumet's best work. I think it's likely Al Pacino's best work. But please rent Scarface. This is possibly the best movie I have ever seen. Dog Day Afternoon, a true story.